What up guys, I'm back for another week of vlog. So this week I've had a whole crazy week of reports and papers, oh my god. Yesterday I finally finished my 29 paper research project, oh, that was, uh, that was terrible. And then I came back thinking what should I do for the rest of the week. So this week I want to talk to you guys about marriage, and marriage is a very definitive term, isn't it? when you get to choose that special someone to be, to be spending your life with. Dating is that moment, that time period where you get to see if you want to be with this person or not, or start a relationship with this person. Being 20 years old, we are always changing as 20. This is the decade where you, your brain is being rewired as to how life is. Everything is happening when you're 20 years old. You have your career happening, relationships, some family work, and then you have school. Everything in, in, in their 20 years old is preparing yourself to become a better person as an adult in your 30s. A lot of people recently have found out that 20 is like an extension to your adolescence. Kids have a very important development stage at the first five years in their life. For us 20s, we need to think of that as when we were five years old, when we were, we were first born. Everything is just defining to the moment. Preparing for marriage is very, not difficult, but it is tedious. Because we don't want to be that person who picks the closest boyfriend or girlfriend they have at 20 or 29 and marries them. I'm not asking you guys to marry at 20 or 25. No, that's not what I'm asking you to do. Being with them, you understand what flaws they have and what qualities they have that could or could not benefit you in the future. We see a lot in the news how people are divorcing so many times when they're 40 or just like just a few years of the relationship really. Look at Kim Kardashian, only two, wait not even two years, like a few hours, wait, a week, a week, I think a week. And then she just wanted to break up the marriage after she married this guy. Well, she's not 20 years old, she's 30 something and she did not prepare herself for this. She's been getting boyfriends as opposed to looking forward to marriage in her life. When you pick someone to be married to, it's not a one year plan, not a five year plan, not even a ten year plan, it's for life. You make those vows as to, to death do us part. What you need to do is to understand this little message I'm going to tell you guys. We do not pick our parents. We don't have a chance to pick on who's our kids. But what one thing we have in our whole marriage is that we get to pick our life partner. That is a very important time in your life when you finally decide who is your life partner. I hope you guys enjoy what I said. See you later.